Good morning, super cool party people, and welcome back to the vlog. Wow, to, to mornings. This morning has been a great start. Uh, I guess my fans in my room, which are so loud, were so loud that I could not hear my alarm going off for 20 minutes. So I definitely woke up late, but it's fine. I'm here. And then there's construction. So I'm here, but I'm a little bit late, but it's fine. I slept a lot better last night even though I slept for less time because I wasn't as hot. I was still warm, but the fans and being able to have my window open made a huge difference. It's a little bit after eight now because of the above mentioned factors, but I am here. I gotta figure out what the heck I'm doing today. Um, Tuesday, I do my Tuesday tasks anyway, so I've got a couple things to do and then just need to find something to do so it should be fun anyways i'm here i'm awake i'm up and i'm gonna go have my breakfast drink and then i'm gonna roll into doing things quite quickly here uh, also it's pouring rain outside it's just uh. <laughs> I have the fabric on this piece at like the perfect tautness and it is amazing. It's so satisfying to put the needle through. I've got the outline done now. I still need to figure out what the next step is, but yes, I just want to point out like how satisfying that was because when I was doing the Santorini piece, the fabric was different and um, problematic at sometimes, but it's fine. Anyways, it is currently, wow, it is 3.30. Like how did that even happen? I got off work at... 1 30 so that's part of how that happened and then i made myself food and i just finished editing yesterday's vlog which is exporting right now which is very exciting and i'm exhausted honestly i'm quite tired and that's not cool i uh also have this lovely mess behind me here still of clothes i pulled them out this morning because i was no I did not pull them out this morning because I was smart and I kept my work clothes separate, but when I got home I was like, I need to change, and so I, I made a mess. So I should probably deal with that. Not just like a probably, like I should definitely deal with that, but we will see when that happens. I am so tired. And part of me is like, hey, you should have a nap. And then the other part of me is being more rational and going, don't have a nap. Like, go to sleep at a regular time tonight, hopefully, because if I do have a nap, I'll just want to just not go to sleep tonight. We'll see what happens though. I think what I need to do is I need to make a list because I do not have one right now. I think that will help and I need to prioritize things and it looks like it stopped raining. It was pouring rain this morning but it looks like it stopped raining now so maybe I should like go out and have a walk. That would probably help. Fresh air keep me awake. It's also not a ridiculous amount of degrees outside. That's not going to help me. It's only 16 degrees out today, which is nice because last time I went for a walk, it was 11 degrees hotter than that. Why did I think that was a good idea? It was a great idea, but <sighs> anyway, so basically I have no idea what the heck I'm going to do, but my room is a little bit cooler, which is much nicer. And um, I'm just vibing right now. <laughs> I should definitely do something though, but I gotta wait till the vlog exports, if nothing else. And so in that time, I can maybe figure something out. It's so bad over there. It is so bad. But that's where we're at. Just wanted to update. I also think I got a slight tan the other day, which makes sense because I did go out in the sun when it was 27 degrees out. I did put sunscreen on, but <laughs> anyways, I'm just rambling now. I'm going to go and hopefully deal with that. I say hopefully, like, it's not my choice. It is very much my choice, but whatever. Anyways, whatever. Like a bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time, it's clear to see From up here, the world seems small We can sit together, it's so beautiful You know, I thought because it was a lot less hot outside it wouldn't suck as much and it did not suck as much I will give it that but it was still quite warm outside but I did a brisk three ish K just over top 
over top, just over 3K. And um, yeah, I feel good. That definitely woke me up. So endorphins, you rock. And um, I'm home now. It's 20 after 5. I'm reading the clock. I don't know why I struggle sometimes. Um, it's 20 after 5. I'm going to go downstairs and start peeling potatoes for dinner, I believe, which is like my least favorite thing to do. I hate peeling potatoes. I don't know why. Like when I cook myself hash browns, I just scrub that and cook them with the skin on. I love potato skin, but you can't do that for mashed potatoes. Or if you do, you're a weirdo, in my opinion. <laughs> mashed potatoes are sacred. Anyways, uh, so mashed potatoes need to be started I believe we're having some roast tonight and mashed potatoes and I'm not sure what else I have still made no progress over there other than making my bed which was something new also my intention was to go for like a 6k walk which takes me about an hour but I think I must have tweaked my knee a little bit at work because when I got up to like go to the washroom before I got ready to go for my walk my one knee was so painful so pulled out my trusty KT tape, which fortunately I have, and I taped it up, and even then I was like, I don't think I can do this, so I stretched for a bit, and then we were good, so did the 3K, not the 6 that I wanted to, but baby steps, also there's a dead sea lion on my walk that I go on, and it just reeks, <laughs> there's like Department of Fisheries signs up that say this is a biohazard site, or whatever, something to that effect, it just reeks so bad, and it's like, it's still barely decomposed, so ugh, that's gonna suck, especially as it gets hotter. But I super went off on a tangent there, so I'm gonna go and I'm gonna do the thing I said I was gonna do and drink a lot of water. Hopefully. Yes. <laughs> Alrighty, well, I'm here to report that it is significantly later. It is 10 30. Dinner was good, except then I felt terrible afterwards, and I've started to realize that. After, I think, I think it's after I eat corn, I always feel really terrible, so I'm like, maybe I shouldn't eat corn, so gonna have to do some experimenting with that, because I was out for like an hour just laying on the bed in so much pain. <laughs> so, that's where we're at, but I'm happy to say I folded none of my clothes, but they're off my bed because they are back in the hamper once again <laughs> uh, tomorrow hopefully tomorrow. And let's see. I actually did a fair amount on my list, all things considered. I did not fold my clothes and put them away and I did not do any writing. Other than that, I did everything. So good job me. I also did a little bit more embroidery on this. I decided to go with floral and I'm really, really liking how it looks, especially in the one color. It's kind of like super busy, but it's almost just like I filled it, but it's there's design. Oh, my battery's about to die. One sec. Yeah, so as I was saying, I um, am really liking that. I do have some insides of the flowers that I was thinking about doing in a color, but I don't know now. I might just leave them as is. We'll see. I'm thinking I might just do all French knots for the Triforce, which I'll probably regret because they're such a pain to do, and I'm still not an expert at them. I would say like 90% of the time they turn out the way I want, but there's that 10% of the time that I'm like, what just happened? I ruined everything, so we'll see. But so far, so good. I also packed up Santorini, my five inch hoop of Santorini, which I'm sending to a friend. So it is in a box beside me here. Um, we'll see how it ships. I think it's like the box is like the perfect size. It was my Lush box and I wrapped it up really well. So hopefully it's still intact when it gets to her. But, um, that's, that's exciting news. It got real hot. I closed my curtain for like two seconds so that I could change and it got really hot all of a sudden in here. Awesome. But yeah, so I got a lot of stuff done. I've now downloaded all of Psych and all of White Collar. So we're almost there. I just have Brain, or Brain, Brain, Covert Affairs to download. I don't think I'm gonna bother downloading Survivor because who needs to binge watch Survivor? Um, I mean me sometimes but yeah so I'm feeling pretty good about that so all things considered especially because I was like down and out for the count for quite some time I feel like I did pretty well today but it is getting late it is about 10 30 so I think it's almost time to go to bed I am currently watching an episode of White Collar because it's such a good show and I haven't watched it forever so I think I'm gonna watch this maybe I'll do a little bit more work on my on my Triforce or maybe I won't we'll see um, but I'll check with you definitely before I go to bed. Alrighty, it is that time to go to bed. It 
Bleibt's an! Lights up. Sheet, blanket, whatever it is, pulled back. Oh, there's pillows everywhere. Alrighty, so that's it for me. It is 20 after 11. I'm about to climb under my blankets, and if it's too hot, I'm pulling out my sheet. I really, I hate sheets. I hate sheets so much. Give me a duvet any day. Um, and also the sheet that I bought is not very breathable, so I hate it for like two reasons. Anyways, that's a problem for another day or maybe some more online shopping. I gotta stop. You know, yesterday I said I need to stop online shopping. Yeah, today I bought more hoops. I haven't even got the last hoops that I ordered, but I bought more hoops today. They're different sizes, so it's fine. Anyways, with that, I'm going to say thank you for coming along on today's adventure, and I will see you tomorrow, probably, when similar things happen. <laughs> Good night. <laughs>